So with this video, I'm going to explain one of the biggest, probably the biggest attraction in Krakow, which is Vavo Castle. Vavo Castle was the royal castle of Poland for many, many centuries before one of the kings decided to move the capital away from this city to Warsaw, which is the uh, current capital now. And so Vavo Castle now, it's a museum. Not just one museum, but it is seven, I think, or something, different exhibits. Each exhibit has its own ticket. And all the indoor exhibits have no photos. So this footage is for the only two things for which you could actually record. One of them is this archery tower. And the other one is a um, architecture tour where you just walk outside and the guide explains the different architecture and gardens of the castle, which you'll see a little bit later on in the video. And the first thing I want to say is that this is one of the, probably the best run museum castles I've ever been to. Um, each, attra each exhibit has a limited number of entries per day. And Almost all of them are timed entries. So when you go to the ticket office, you tell them, you know, which of the exhibits you would like to go to, and they will just figure out the schedule for you on the spot. And it, you know, on the uni unified ticket, it tells you basically when you should go to what exhibit. And it's very good because, you know, a lot of exhibits in Western Europe are overcrowded, you go in and you really can't see anything because it's just crowds and crowds of people and tour groups. And it's like a rather unpleasant museum experience. Whereas here, um, I guess their system makes sure that there's only a maximum number of people at any given time so that you know people who go through these exhibits can actually see the stuff that's on the exhibit. The other thing is that, um, in addition to the castle, there's a cathedral, which is like right next to the castle. And it itself has its own ticket and exhibits. And actually, to me, the cathedral was probably the most impressive thing I saw on this hill. The, the castle's on the hill. Um, what struck me the most was that there were some tapestries in the cathedral. And the ones closest to the altar were nature tapestries. They weren't religious ones, which I thought was pretty interesting. And the last thing is that um, in the castle exhibits, I think the most impressive ones were the collection of tap tapestries. One of their kings really loved this stuff, and it managed, most of it managed to survive through the centuries. And some of them are now on uh, one of the exhibitions. Um, but... Yeah, to me, the, the cathedral was definitely the highlight of my visit here. And it really does remind me of Westminster in London because, well, they're both royal cathedrals. You know, they have the same type of royal chapels, the tombs, um, the, the Christian decorations, very similar stuff. And same vibe and it's just pretty cool to see anyways this um so that's my impression of avo castle and yeah i really like the ticket system